Are you interested to find out what the top five pubs are in downtown Edmonton? Well, then this video is for you. Hi, I'm Jen McPhillamy, real estate associate realtor with Yegg Pro Realty. Welcome to my downtown dwellers series where I'm going to provide you with information and insight all about downtown Edmonton from a local downtown dwellers perspective. In this episode, I'm going to share with you my top five pubs in downtown Edmonton. Before we get started, don't forget to click that subscribe button and the little bell so you don't miss out on videos I post weekly. Okay, so let's get started. Number five, The Pint. It's located on 109th Street between Jasper Ave and 102nd Ave. The Pint is huge, so if you have a small group or a large group, you're likely to find seats for everyone. In addition, for those summer months, they have a large west-facing patio, which is great to grab drinks and catch some rays after work. If you go to The Pint, Wings are a must. They have a ton of flavors and they are all delicious. If you think the pint might be a good option for you before a Rogers Place event, just note that it's about a 10 to 15 minute walk. If you're not up for the walk though, you may be able to grab one of those handy e-scooters just outside. Okay, number four, the Rosen Crown. It's located on 103rd Ave, just east of 101st Street. The Rosen Crown may be a pretty perfect option for a pre-Rogers Place event. One, they're only a block away, they allow kids till 9 p.m., and if you don't feel like going outside, you're connected to the Pedway system that goes right to Rogers Place. If you're thinking of checking out the Rosen Crown, it's a British style pub with a ton of craft beer. One of my favorite things about the Rosen Crown is the live piano music on Friday and Saturday nights. They take requests, it is super fun. Number three. Finn McCool's. Now, this hidden gem you will find on the fourth level of City Center Mall. It's right beside Landmark Cinemas. But that might not help if you didn't know we had cinemas downtown. Anyway, right across the street from the uh, Rogers Place and, and beside Delta Hotel. That helps. If you aren't walking to Finn McCool's and you decide to drive to an event or what, whatever reason you drove to downtown, if you go to Finn McCool's, they offer their patrons $5 parking. It's amazing. What is also good about Finn McCool's, if you're bringing kids with you to a Rogers Place event, they allow kids until 9 p.m. Other fun nights at Finn McCool's include Wednesday night pub stumpers and dinner and a movie on Sundays. Number two, Sherlock Holmes. This is another British pub and it's located in like an old style British home and you can't miss it because it has that British red phone booth on the outside. It looks like a house in the middle of downtown. I love this pub for its quaint feel and atmosphere. Even though it might look small, there's a ton of seating inside and there's even a second level you can book off for events. Plus, their patio is huge and it faces south. Not as close to Rogers Place, but not as far as the Pint. Also, you can access the ped underground pedway system which can connect you to the above ground pedway system and you can make it to Rogers Place without really walking too much outside. I really enjoy coming to this pub at lunch and on Fridays and Saturdays for their live music. On to number one, Kelly's Pub. It's located on 104th Street between Jasper Ave and 102nd Ave. Now to be honest, I do frequent this one the most and maybe has a little bit to do with that it's a half a block from my house, but also the staff there is amazing. When I walk into Kelly's, I feel like Norm from Cheers. And Good afternoon, everybody. Ah! And if you don't know what Cheers is, it's a sitcom from the late 80s, early 90s, about a friendly pub in Boston. I would describe Kelly's as an Irish pub mixed with a sports pub. There are plenty of TVs to watch the game, and they always have the game playing. One of my favorite days to go there is Sunday. In addition, they have a great patio with bowls of water for your dog. So if you want to go grab a couple drinks in the patio, eh, just tie your dog up outside beside you and they have something to drink too. The owner of this pub, Kelly, is amazing. She's really involved in the community and she even offers a few free, free meals throughout the year. I've been there for the turkey dinner on Thanksgiving and Kelly's pub's birthday where it was a roast beef dinner. There's 
absolutely no pressure to buy anything and the meal was free it was great of course we bought something so we wanted to have something to drink with it and anyway it was awesome and really surprised that they did it for free if you're gonna choose Kelly's pub for a Rogers Place event it's about two blocks away not a very long walk at all and kids are allowed there till about three well that sums up my top five pubs in downtown Edmonton Stay tuned for more downtown dweller local knowledge in my upcoming videos. Thanks for watching and take care. Bye.